Good afternoon, folks. I'm the Voice of Dog, and welcome back to Yakuza Zero. Oh, I hang on. Muted the game. Right, right. There we go. There we go. There's that intro I need to see. So last time, we began our story as Kazuma Kiryu budding Yakuza boy who had to leave due to getting blamed for a crime and instead of doing the usual Yakuza thing where you just get murdered he decided uh, to not deal with that. Right, you guys can't see anything. Hang on, just a second. There we go. <laughs> also, I skipped the intro. I'm sorry. Sorry about that. I unlocked some new things. Oh. Oh, so I can, like, replay cutscenes and stuff? That's cool. That's neat. There's a lot of cutscenes in this game. Surely you'd want to see a couple of them again. Let's continue. So, Kiryu is no longer part of the Yakuza, but they are trying to kill him. Uh, he is trying to solve a sort of real estate mystery. Because the place where the person was killed was an empty lot that is actually very key to the real estate development of Kamurocho. Uh, we met with a mysterious guy named Tachibana, who heads Tachibana Real Estate. And... Apparently, he's been buying up some land in the area. And it was around this area, in fact. It was around Theater Square, which is why I'm kinda, I ended the stream kind of wandering around here trying to find something. I'm sure there's something around here. I was just unable to find it. Something about a place that recently got bought. How big is Theater Square? Theater Square is... Okay, there's also... Oh, excuse me. Well, someone needs to get punched. Yeah, there's some guys over there in the park, too. They may just be fights, but I'll check them out as well. In beast mode. Hang on, gotta take this bike. Oh. Here, have my, have my spare contact lenses. Thank you, sir. Those guys in black are gone from the children's park. I guess they were a random encounter. Racers wanted. Racers, you say? I think I walked past this last time. Oh, hang on. Oh, good. They just relocated. I'm glad we, we found each other. Oh, wrong direction. Can I charge triangle moves? Seems like no, but I can hold down... My regular punch. Alright, that's my guard, where I can just build up heat. But if I let go, then I'm going to get hit. What was my grab? Oh, it was circle for the grab. Yeah! Right, that crowd control heat move. Seems pretty okay. Sorry. Eventually, you can try a triangle. Yeah, there's like a, a variety of things you end up... Beppin. Beppin. The Dinning Bar. Beppin. What? What was that? Oh, was that for the... No, I don't want to do that. Where would you take me, anyway? Oh, I can just go to any... Okay, cool. Oh, and right, right, I can go to the pier to get trained in beast mode if I want, which I'm going to have to... Oh, there's a standing around hint? Let me see that. 
Let me see what they say to me. There's actually a thing for that? That's useful. I appreciate that. I just happened to mash through it. Ah, my thinking cigarette. Yeah. It's off Theater Alley. Okay, so Theater Square. There it is. Thank you, game. But... But racing. Oh, hang on. Do I have enough heat? No, I have no heat. The slam it is. So I can tank a lot of damage, but not all of the damage. Come on, grab it. Grab it? Okay, so I can chain those together. See, I'm still trying to figure out beast mode a bit. There we go. It has a very deliberate rhythm to it. Nice. I'll take that. I don't need any bait. Okay. Can I make it to the racing league? We are seven minutes into stream and I am already distracted. This is how it goes. Everyone's doing it these days, but mostly young kids. Hi. Beast mode feels a little weird to control because of how deliberate all the movements are. Yeah, I was wondering about that. Where is the pachinko? I at least want to see what a pachinko machine actually feels like, and I feel like they would do a good job representing that. Actually, well then, maybe that wouldn't be all that fun, because those things are rigged against you as all hell, aren't they? Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll check this place out real quick before we... <laughs> God, these tracks. Yes, this guy. Hell yeah. This extremely shiny man. <laughs> I remember being at, like, a church carnival one year. I was, like, volunteering or something. And, uh... And they had a, a, I don't remember if it was a slot car or some other racing car kind of thing, but it was pretty neat, regardless. And it was kind of, it was in like, you know, a classroom like this. Well. We like to keep things casual around here. <laughs> How long has Pachinko been around that long? Has it been around since the 80s? Yeah, I gotta customize your cars. Incoming windows noise. There we go. Pachinko's pretty old. That reminds me. Should adjust where my chat is. Forgot about that. May have forgotten that it needs to be a little higher. In the 20s? Wow. So it's been around as long as slot machines, right? No, slot machines have been around longer than that, I think. Uh. 
Nice. <laughs> Please, I need people my age to get involved. I'm I'm lonely. <laughs> I need some adults to talk to. I get all the components for this for this thing. Okay, boost and stabilize. Thank you for that follow, Pixie Man. Welcome to Slot Cars. Press a button. <laughs> I like the song on that. Build your friendship. Yeah, sure. Well, can I can I customize my car at all? Oh man, this song. All right, I only have one car. Ultra low profile tires. Jumps. I don't. I don't know. Ultra rocket frame. Also, yeah, this feels like I'm playing Daytona all of a sudden with this music. So I'm not allowed to just... <laughs> might actually be a problem. Yeah, this stuff all seems really dangerous. What a color palette. Beautiful. All right. Yeah, I, I really changed my load uh my loadout.
cost limit, I see. Introduction race. Alright, so that one is 40. 14 months and now it's time for Crime Dog. Discard, thank you for that sub. For 14 whole months, thanks a bunch. Alright, if that's the capacity, then I can put like one other thing on my car. Which means I can trick out, like, one thing here. <laughs> May actually be a problem. Let's get that- let's get that side stabilizer. We've got three more parts. Or, we got three more capacity. Yeah, there we go. Some speed and acceleration. All right. We are ready. Oh, you can customize them here. I see. All right. Good to know. <laughs> Ready to beat all these children? It's lock car racing. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Good start. Lap one out of eight. I want to probably use my boost after I have to do that change lane. Like, now. Yeah! Eat shit, nerds! Oh, someone fell off already. Go! <laughs> Where's the crowd of sad children around him? Can I win the next? Let's see if I can win the next race. How old is Kazuma? He's only 21? Seriously? Oh, man. This gets pretty intense quickly, huh? A fun challenge for young razors. Oh, there's a jump in this one. That was the one for jumps. Ah, right, let's see how we do. Where's the jump? Or is the jump that bump there? <laughs><笑> Mm, these guys are pretty fast. Social standing can be turned on its head in the blink of an eye. Oh no! Oh, right before the, the ramp. There goes half my gauge. There goes the other half of my gauge. Oh, 
Yeah, boost seems like a lie. I'm out of boost as well. Go! Fourth place! Just him being so sad at losing to these children is incredible. Is one of my favorite things in this game that I've seen. It's so good. God. All right. We'll we'll come back to this. This game within the game. Had a nice little warm up here. The alley. Look, it's complicated. You can't expect me to do my job with those guys. All right? I have no family. I see a bike over there. Excuse me. Handled. 20 million yen! I assume that's total because I've spent quite a bit of money at this point. Tachibana didn't do anything particularly violent, but they kind of know a lot. And they're not Yakuza. She <sighs> Shiichi Fuku Street. Okay, where is that? 
over here. I'm pretty sure that Kamarocho is like the red light, one of the red light entertainment districts. I just tanked that hit while I'm slamming this guy. Oh, I lost all my heat. Oh. Oh, so it's not real? It's not. It's based off a, another, a real district. Also, looking at my, uh, hang on. Put that chat up a bit more, so it's out of the way. I need to use some food, actually. Korean barbecue. Sounds good. Hello. Oh, I'm just short of heat. There we go. Get up so I can heat. Yeah. So it sounds like they did an okay job of representing. What's your deal? Let's get involved. I wouldn't say I've seen too many Mafia movies. A few. Goodfellas, The Bronx Tale, The Godfather, standard ones. Sure, we'll help out. Let's go stalk this girl. Let's help P 
people with their problems. But first... Oh. Oh, I thought this was the one. No. Korean barbecue is down the road. Sorry, have to eat first. You know how it is. Where is it? Oh, I just... Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Give me the beaver bat. Fantastic. However, oh, that's a uh... million yen vending machine. And protect against bullets. Well, hey guys, you look a bit displaced. Also, yeah, I did just put $10,000 into that vending machine. God. Ugh. I die. You don't even know what you're getting. I like that sign. Welcome to the Snack Cat. この店は何時から開くんだ。誰店ならまだ準備中だよ。立花不動産の話を聞きに来たんだが、あんたここの店の<笑> 店長だけどもしかして人生一家の人人生一家なんだ違うのかよおいちょっと少しだけ話を聞かせてくれないかあんた橘不動産にこのビルから追い出されそうなんだろう何なの さっき言ってた人生一家ってのがです登場会の四時団体でこの店のケツ持ちしてたヤクザ毎月きっちり見かじめりを取ってたくせによ橘不動産に追い払われちまってああ呆れたもんだよこのビルの他の店はもう橘
checking out people that Tachibana Real Estate has tried to muscle out of their their property. Well, good. We need to meet. さん。どうも、生瀬さん。どうすか。立ち抜きの件に考えてくれましたう、うちは出て行きませんよ。そう言っても、このビルはもううちがオーナーになってるわけだし、勝手な都合を並べて居座られちゃ困っちゃうんだ
今夜あたりお電話いただけそうですねいいお返事を期待していますよどきこんな町で妙な正義感におわせちゃ命が危ないよお兄さんおわさびはほどほどにしないとねまあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まあ、まああ出てけと言われてさっさと出てた連中はバカだ辛抱を重ねりゃこういうボーナスが出てくるってのよだつ like 60k I think roughly you know I don't know the exact so, someone said last stream what the current uh, conversion was Given inflation and all that. If someone told me to move and gave me 60,000, 60 grand to do it, I would do that. Absolutely. That's, uh. That would get me out of the hole at least. どういう連中なんだ、立花不動産って。何が目的か知らんけど、あそこに関わるのはやめときな。あの人たちは、カムロ町の闇だよ。闇。俺から見りゃ、ヤクザなんかよりよっぽど怖い。カムロ町中に目と耳を張り巡らせてるから。相手がヤクザだろうが弱み見つけ出してすぐに金玉握っちまう人生一家もその手で追い払われたってわけか<笑>聞いた話じゃ人生一家の組長この間登場会本家から呼び詰めさせられたらしいよ何本家への上納金ちょろまかしてんのが匿名で作られてねもっとも作られたのはそのほんの一部全部ぶちまけられたら組長は絶対殺されるっていうなるほど立花が小出しに作って脅しをかけたってことだ別に俺は立花さんとこがやったなんて一言も言ってないよただヤクザのそんな弱み探り出せんのあそこ以外にはまずないだろうけどね俺があとあんたに言ってやれるのは立花からは手を引けって忠告くらいだね。Yeah, I was actually a little distracted from that scene because of the scene before it. I was still kind of thinking about it. They might be worse than the Yakuza. All right, some other homeless guys in Park Boulevard that I got. Money will absolutely change your values. I personally have been thinking a lot about how I think about money in general and how that has changed over time from being a, you know, from growing up as a pretty, you know, middle class suburban kid to going to college and accumulating a lot of debt. It has changed my perspective a bit. Oh, he's there now. Do I want to do that? I don't know if I want to do that right now. It's kind of a frustrating mini game, the avoid the attacks one. I've got some money I could spend. I could spend it on beast mode. 
<clears throat> yeah, when the bubble bursts, a lot of people are going to be uh, pretty lost. Charge attack in beast mode. Okay. Oh, there's my charge attack on triangle. Let's take that. Reduces heat loss. I did beat the first Punch Artist minigame. I beat one. You know what? Maybe I'll take a... Maybe I'll take a swing at it after I take a swing at these guys. Charge. Oh, I can hold this down as long as I want. Oh my! Oh my! There he goes. Nice. What was that lady doing? Also, how did we get here? How did we get into this little parking lot here? We were fighting in this alley right here. And then we teleported. That was kind of weird. Wait, no, guys. No, guys, come on. Follow me. We got to fight over here. Yeah, over here. Let's fight over here. 10,000 yen. All right, that's only like 100 bucks. That's that's not a... Barely an investment. Oh, oh my. Some champagne. Hell yes. Okay, so it's not a brand. It's just... Hey, here's some champagne. Is that maybe one of the alcohols I'm going to need? Oh, upgrade rush style. Okay, I still have some money. Let's see what I can do here. Hold a movement direction and press A during X attack. Oh, I need the M's. Ah, I see. Okay, so I'm pretty far from all of those. All right, understood. Understood. Um, I didn't, I wasn't imagining that, right? There he is. He's only got 10 million yen. Honestly, I don't think it's worth it. I don't think I could take him. Not not with beast mode, that's for sure. I think I would... I think I would extremely screw that up. Yeah, I think I heard someone say that rush mode is ideal for for beating up Mr. Shakedown. Ah, shit. I was just about to let it go. Nice. 
145 yen to the dollar and 89. Nice. It seems pretty worth it when you get gold, when you get stuff like gold plates, because those sell for a bit, right? I know I got a diamond and a platinum plate. I should sell those at some point. Silverware is easy money. Okay. Public Park 3. Other side of town. Well, let's go work our way over there. Let's have a nice walk across Comorocho. This really is a nice town that they rendered here, and I appreciate how well it's done. And how much is in it. The sheer amount of content. I'm going the wrong way. Sorry. No. So he does have a, a retreat. Also, how they, they managed to make these random encounters feel just brief enough. Like, that they don't drag you down, and they seem pretty worthwhile. You know what? Let's let's take a nice, uh, let's... I, I You know, we've had a pretty good night here. Um, no reason we can't go to the Champion District here and get ourselves a drink. Is that... I can't pick it up. Ah, oh, there we go. Yeah! Now, can I get a drink, please? Is that allowed? Man. Real cramped here, huh? Earth Angel. Yeah, this man, man, look at this, look at this tiny little street. I really like this. I mean, it's, it's a little claustrophobic, but just. Here we go. Space is a premium, but this place doesn't seem cramped to me. <sighs> Soju? The McCallum. Brandy. It's a bright, fruity aroma and smooth taste. 
very superior old pale. I didn't know that. And I don't think I've ever drank brandy. I don't really know what it's supposed to taste like. What is this? I just kind of want to know what this is. Korean soju. Oh, this is the, the proprietor talking. Mom looks out for you, I guess. We are pretty drunk. My controller is vibrating a little bit. It's pulsating. Can I... Can I just go... To the other bar? I mean... I don't gotta eat... I mean, I don't gotta drink all at the same bar, okay? What is soju exactly? Mm -hmm. Oh, does this bar have some story at it? See, we got our drinks anyway. No, I'm still very much a crime boy. Kind of doesn't leave you. Hey. I, I just realized, why is this guy... Why is this guy referred to as nihilistic man? Also, yeah, this, now this is a hole in the wall bar. This is what I was expecting from the other place. <laughs> yeah. We know a little bit about that. Yeah, all these interiors just look really good. Just in general. And they, they all feel like a bar that I've been in before. Hi. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, right. That's his code. Yeah. So I would accidentally... Yeah, I would mm, potentially accidentally set off the deal. Were I to order in this bar. Nani? Mm hmm. Ah. Mm. 
Yeah, guns are not very legal in Japan. Oi. Okay. Now let's go have a drink. Yeah. Bowmore. Yeah, now let's drink rum. Yeah, sure. That's a great idea after drinking whiskey and also brandy and also whatever. Actually, no, we haven't really had too much. Oh, boy. I would be dead by now. I can't really drink hard liquor in any great quantity. No. No. Okay. Where were we going again? Oh, oh. Oh. Is there a poor... Uh, I'm assuming because it's Yaku Yakuza that this isn't... I don't know. I've heard that the uh, the foxy boxing or whatever they call it, the cat fighting is pretty bad, and I probably will be skipping that, but I don't think that's in this part of the game. I'll check it out briefly. Oh, yeah. Wait. I thought there was a different side quest like this, but... Okay, but there's nothing here right now. That's right. I'm supposed to be going to the other corner of the city here. Brawler in a while. Ah. Oh, I was like, are, are we gonna? Are we going to? Are, are we gonna?
Yeah, working in those places would be absurdly gross. Extremely kind of gross. Super gross. I can imagine it, but I don't want to. Yeah, it's just like fucking keep hosing the place down, probably. It's probably your main job. Yeah, I guess I gotta do this quest, huh? Pretty sure I know what this quest is. Wait! You there! You guys are full of shit. This is dumb. I'm leaving. I got to do some uh, broadcast stuff tangentially in college. It was pretty fun. I basically helped produce like a uh, a knockoff whose lines it anyway. <laughs> You know, working in the room doing chirons and, and setting up the shit and sometimes you operating cameras and stuff. It was good. Com the comedy was extremely hit or miss, but you know, student comedians. Fake it till you make it, Kiryu. Come on, no one actually knows what they're doing. That's the biggest illusion in all of showbiz. No one knows what the fuck they're doing. Yeah. Yeah. Producer Kiryu. Oi. <laughs> Nah, I'm just gonna go with my heart on these choices. Ah, uh. uh, this guy, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the keys for ass and goofy are right <laughs> for cute and goofy are next to each other. Huh? No, he's extremely not. But yes, he is.
That's your idea, Goofy? Eh? Uh huh? Uh? Despite all the film-related stuff I've done, I've never heard the term erasable before. I'm just really tempted to take the eraser. Really tempted to take that eraser. This is the erasable. You like that? Fantastic. Good job, Karyu. Yeah, I'm gonna guess it's the price is right thing. <laughs> that one makes more sense to me. <laughs> yes. There is no need to explain that because I clearly understand that. Thank you. strike the set means you're, you're gonna tear down set and you know yeah I assume we're just going to remove those dishes I could punch those dishes
maybe I should have punched the dishes. I don't know. I'm afraid to screw up these things normally, but they, they don't usually... It's usually just like flavor text, isn't it? So maybe I should pick more silly options. Oh, okay, payout. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, so maybe I would have gotten something slightly better. What? Oh no! I love their synchronized walking. I don't know. Usually, the people. Usually, when people are striking, they have a good reason to. Are we supposed to be on the director's side here? Huh? Hang on, I gotta beat these mutinous people who, Boy. you know, probably right. are getting worked a bit too much. Oh wow, where'd you get <laughs> Where'd you get that from? I love beating up this guy with the same outfit. Oh my god! Well, bye. Uh. <laughs> well, obviously. <laughs> I think this is the first time we're hearing the after school special music. It's really good. This plays at the end of many side quests <laughs> while they're while they're giving you some heartfelt thing. There's always a good good sense of tongue in cheek humor about it. TV gives people hopes and dreams. TV can change people's lives for the better. I bet people really thought that in the 80s. <laughs> I think we know better now. Uh. We are the dream weavers. <laughs> yeah. 
Kato maybe tries to get too much out of my out of his crew. Made his previous crew pretty angry. side quest there that was actually not the side quest I was thinking of I was thinking of a different one but we may run into that one as well Bikes. Ah. But I should put on this Time to keep drinking. Beer. Also a whiskey. Just whiskey. <sighs> Have not killed anyone yet. Kiryu cannot kill anyone. Alright, now that we are good and drunk. Doesn't that not matter because I'm singing? Oh, oh, that's right. I'm... Oh, I should have been lively. I gotta come back with a date. <laughs> you have sexy, 
Alright. Onward. Alright, next time we'll do lively. We, we will interject lively. I just love the term lively interjections. It's pretty good. Drugstore? My inventory is full. Well, fortunately... Oh, I should hold on to that. This is chapter two. I just want to see what they have. Oh, they've got stuff. I see. So that's where I go for stuff, for the good stuff. Good to know. Let's see if I have any more points to spend here. I don't know how into business I'm going to get. We'll see. Hey, what's up? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? Oh. Just trying to go down the street, guys. It's really hard to walk down the street. Ah, 
あんたらに話聞かせてもらいたいんだが今構わないかおおあ別にいいけど何そうだなあ、ah, only I had beer あんた話聞きてあ,あそれ随分流暢にしゃラーメンラーメンレンメンラーメン<笑>わかったただその前に一つだけ聞かせてくれあんたらの中で立花不動産と仕事をしたことがあるってやつは<笑> Alright then <笑>なるほど Alright 酒なら何でもいいってわけじゃねえからなそれぞれの好みに合った酒じゃねえとよかったじゃん。はい。もう Sake, huh? Do I have any sake? I do. Oh, shit, champagne. Yeah, I gotta go to my box to get that. Whiskey? I think I might have. Or scotch. Hang on. Yeah, you're the fancy guy. Yeah, I'm good, thanks. Alright, so I need... Wait. Do I not have the sweet potato sochu? I thought I had that. Yeah, I definitely have that. <laughs> nice handoff. Uh-huh. All right, so I need... Oh, hello. I'm a little busy here, but sure. I need here? Right, champagne. Champagne and scotch. I've tried sake and I don't think I really like it that much. But I haven't had it at different temperatures. I think I've only had it like kind of warm.
I have not had Sochu. I have no idea what that is. Hmm. Don Quixote. Where am I going? Oh no. Oh no! So, I think I heard that this is supposed to be DQ3. Because this is about the time it was. Which is great, because I played DQ3 a lot as a kid. And, got, and would just rent it and get lost in it. It seemed like the biggest game at the time. Also, yeah, reading manuals on the way home. Hey, now. Yeah, I do miss reading the manual. So, wait, did that start the quest? <laughs> okay, uh, so I guess that's good for now. God, look how cramped this place is. Oh, they've got a lot of stuff, too. Ah, oh, they've got champagne. Yeah, I did get a gold champagne, so I think I'll just take that from my box. Oh, wow, they just straight up have Mountain Dew. Scotch.
Oh no. We're gonna beat the shit out of that kid. Oi. We'll handle this. Gotta go punch a teenager. It's the only way to solve this one. Video game crimes are unacceptable. Is that him? That's him. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Don't tell me. It's a sad thing that your adventure has come to an end. Yeah. Menacing man who talks in video game terms. The product placement works in this game because it's a period game. That's that's why it feels because it's a throwback, and it feels and it lends an air of authenticity to it and makes it more convincing. That's why it works in this game. <laughs> in modern games, it feels like it's trying to compete for your attention so that you actually buy things, and I think that's the part that people find uncomfortable and not as great. You know, nostalgia is okay, but advertising maybe not so much that's just the way I, that's how i see it really i feel like at this point in my life i don't need anyone else competing for my attention in terms of advertisers But when I see an old 1980s Mountain Dew can, I think, oh, cool, that's what it used to look like. And the stuff about the alcohol is just good on its own because it just talks about, you know, hey, this is a really popular brand in Japan. You know, it's it's like the state, you know, it's the flagship product of this company, it's stuff like that. Basic stuff you would hear if you went to like a distillery or something. I might be like it depends if, if Kiwami is like 2005 then I guess maybe it would still be somewhat nostalgic it was a while ago Can't believe 05 was yesterday. Uh, and yes, off topic, but please play Donut County. It was delightful. Oh, hang on. I'm being followed. Okay, his friend's caught up. Get up.
I see, so that's what that is. Yeah, time really is kind of a drag, isn't it? That whole aging thing. Right, I forgot. I was supposed to be looking for... Wow, I ended up... How did I end up going this way? Imported brands. This probably is where I would get some... Uh... Seven Up still exists. I mean, yeah, I know I'm chasing a thief, but I'm also looking for a, a bottle of scotch. So, the other direction. But let me check this store first. I'm glad that I'm not completely locked into this quest. It's just there now. Sorry. Oh, my. Lassie. No alcohol? Come on, Scotch, even though this looks like the other store. Aha! Okay, now I just need that champagne. I guess I might as well complete this side quest while I'm at it, huh? Excuse me. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, man. My video game. What the hell is your shirt saying? Yeah. Ah. Look out, he's got a knife. Look out, he's got a trash can! <laughs> the way this kid runs. <laughs> Mister, I'm not really following this quest line as closely as you are, so. Nani? Uh. Mm -hmm. <sighs> uh? Okay, kid, I admit you are extremely unlucky here, but we're going to get to the bottom of this, I swear. Yes, 
<laughs> Don't buy one legally, just steal from someone. This guy has a gun. Quiet man levels of, es of needless escalation here. He did not try to use that gun. Look guys, Dragon Quest is huge in Japan, okay? You don't understand. Oh yeah, guys with gun, you can get shot in this game, absolutely. It stuns the hell out of you and does a ton of damage, and you don't want it to happen. If someone has a gun, they are your first target in this game. Uh. Yeah, you got the game from a punk, but that game belongs with a little kid first. <laughs> what have I become? Oh no. Oh no. Wait, what? Oh, hi, Dad. This story doesn't really have a moral. It's just a, it's just a weird, zany mishap. Yeah, hire Kiryu to fix your family, because he will somehow fix everything for people. A katana. Okay, now that we've done that... Let's 
use our item box. Guess we can put this in our box. I guess we don't need this. We need our scotch whiskey and we need our gold champagne. I guess we should save as well. Yeah, the sub-stories are, like, neat little silly distractions from the game itself, and they all work pretty well as that. Oh, there's a shiny over there. You know, I should take a quick break, because we're at two hours right now. Yeah, let's take a quick break here, and we'll be right back in uh, about five minutes with more Yakuza.